<laughs> well, so you brought up mindful art. So I'm going to just ask you, like, can you define what that is? And then we're going to talk about like how art became a tool in your life. Sure. Uh, to me, mindful art is where when you sit down, um, you're fully present. Mm-hmm. And you're setting an intention for whatever art project you're doing. Um, so it becomes a meditative process. It also is a, in a way of, a, a way of, of learning self-regulation. Because I, I feel like when you're doing mindful art practices in the moment, it's wonderful, but we're also trying to take that piece with us. I always talk about the chaotic abundance of my life and as soon as we walk out the door into our jobs or into our, into our lives, it's, uh, there's a lot of stress. And so I feel like mindful art, the, the mindfulness that we create in that moment, and that's why I love affirmations because affirmations are powerful mantras. You know, they're like, they're, they're, they're ways that you can take those words with you through the day. And it's powerful with little children to have them come into the office and, and walk through simple things like, you know, when a family comes and I always ask for, what's the, what's the thing about your child you want to tell me that is wonderful, that is positive, that is great? Because, you know, when kids come, they sometimes it's always like, well, this is wrong or that is wrong. We always start with, well, what's wonderful about this kid? Well, this is my, oh, my kid's very brave. So, well, I am brave. Oh. You know, so I think just being able to carry that. So I think a mindful art project is taking the mindfulness, setting that intention when you start doing it. 